guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I thought I would let the boys do the weekly food shop. We what? thought this would be a I'm bit of a twist on a traditional grocery I'm haul, and we've seen a few other channels do this on YouTube, and it looks like so much fun. So, I'm hoping the boys are gonna be sensible because we actually have to live off of this food for the week. Um, but yeah, they need to think about breakfast, snacks, dinner, lunch, all of it. Yeah, so we're gonna get a trolley and let them loose in the supermarket. We've got a trolley with Jackson. So boys, are you gonna be sensible? No. <laughs> Is that your favorite? For the weekends when beans and cheese on toast. You like beans and cheese on toast, don't you? So should we get one of those? How many cans is that? Right, first item. It's going in. We got some beans. That's not too bad. No. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Caleb, are you gonna get nice healthy food? Oh, what's that? Toy Story. Yeah, Toy Story. <laughs> what is it? Toy Story. Then. Is it is it Rice Krispies? Yeah. What's going on here? Oh, they got <laughs> bagels. They're your favourite in the morning. Yeah. Yeah. Get some bagels. Fraser's found the bread that we actually have. Uh, <laughs> don't actually do that with bread, mate. Uh, how's the shopping going? Really good. She's like me all day. Anything so far. That's good. That's good. A really good taste. We got Toy Story and cake. Okay. That's the main thing. Keep distracting him, Jackson. Keep distracting him. Fraser's not as distracted. Uh oh. Uh oh. Then what did you choose? In the in the trolley. In the... <laughs> Back to plan with that. That's good. Found in the Doritos, which I thought you'd get. You found a pack of Oreos. <laughs> Did you plant them there? That's good. We're arguing about not getting cookies. Strawberry butt. A strawberry butt. Which ones look like they could last a few days? No, no. Dad, Dad. Wow, it's a lot of carrots, Bob. Dad. Carrots going in. What are you getting, Bubs? Some broccoli. I like that. Very nice, thank you. Yeah, corn on the cob's good, isn't it, Bub? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I'm liking all the veggies. <laughs> Red pepper? Yeah, maybe... How many? Two. It's a yellow, wow. You can change it, just say. It's okay, it's okay. Caleb, do you think we really need that? Why don't you go back you and get got pizza? Pie, see if you get a deal with the deal. Yeah. Is there a deal? Yeah. Oh, two pizzas. One for daddy, one for me. Oh, lovely. Fraser noticed there's no deal, my favourite. That's good. He noticed. Follow at Astra. <laughs> You're like, oi, <laughs> look at this. You know that's my favourite. <laughs> Watermelon. Wow. We never buy that. Watermelon. Yeah. Okay, put it gently, don't Let's get it. Oh, well done. Very good, Caleb. Oh, look what Fraser's found. What have you got there? Have you just put some grapefruit up your top? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, gosh. Right. Oh, what about some crispies? Yeah, I said that. What's your favourite crispy? Salt and vinegar. Is that salt and vinegar? Yep. Because he's always wanted fortune cookies. What are we doing down here? Obviously trying to find fortune cookies that 
really important um, part of our weekly shop. Feed a family of five on fortune cookies. Might win something. Oh, Caleb, what have you found? What is that? Just when we said there's no food for mummy and daddy, what have you found? Jiffy Puff. But what flavour is it? Butter! You've been looking for that, haven't you? On the hob. I had it in America. And they've got it they in the American do, section. They don't do yeah. butter popcorn, do they usually? No. It's 17 pounds for one piece of popcorn. <laughs> Show us. No. Do you like them? Yeah. Good choice. Oh, what did you get, Caleb? Yeah. A okay. strawberry smoothie. You have it in the morning. Uh, Just going to sneak these in. There's no kid is going to choose eggs. <laughs> what you got? Uh oh, we're bringing back all the bad habits. What did you think of that? <laughs> yeah. Come on. He's trying a phrase of salt and vinegar crisps he just bought. Is it too strong? <laughs> So we're all done shopping and now we're gonna guess what the bill was so what do you think boys how much money did we just spend 130 pounds Fraser's saying 130 Caleb going to for the, uh, 150. 150 from Caleb Jack Jack what do you think what number we're going to Donald's <laughs> we actually heard what how much it was oh, I didn't I love oh, guess. did you not? No. Okay, okay. I rent £73.65. <laughs> Roughly. And what was it? Oh, £73.65. <laughs> Get <laughs> what in! Uh, that's not too bad. So let's go home now and see what we actually got for that amount of money. I was the closest. And how we're going to live off of that for a week. And how we're going to survive. Oh. I've just got home and I've laid everything out to show you properly what the boys chose. They're actually up in the bath now. We got back so late. We were having so much fun in there that it's actually now seven o'clock. So they are upstairs having a bath. So I will quickly run through. I know you saw quite a few of the things while we were buying them, but I think I'll just show you everything. So this is everything laid out on our counter. So I'll just run through what we've got. I think I'll start out over here because this is the first thing they picked up as soon as we ran in they just shouted toy story and grabbed it and i was like do you even know what this is and they were like no but it looks like it is toy story rice krispies i think uh but i'm fine with that i'm fine with rice krispies so not you know that's fine this one though is nesquik which they've never had before i do let the boys have chocolate for breakfast or like a bit of chocolate with breakfast on a sunday so this will definitely have to be a sunday morning breakfast um, so yeah we've got that they also bought milk and as some of you will know we have a milk service so we get it delivered three times a week um, so we probably didn't need this but they do drink a lot of milk so I think as soon as they saw it they were like we're gonna need that so they got that they also got some breaded chicken goujons because they probably do they have that like once every two weeks and they really love goujons and they also got some chipolatas that is their favorite type of sausage then you might have seen Matt sneak some eggs in because Matt has eggs every morning for breakfast so he grabbed them they also got some actamel we did used to buy actamel I kind of stopped for a bit because I was thinking it was filling them up before breakfast but they love them so they got a whole pack of them they also bought an innocent seriously strawberry smoothie I normally make smoothies at home um, Caleb loves them so yeah they got the strawberries and banana ones so they can have a little bit of that with breakfast they also got um, some wholemeal bread this is the one we normally get so it was interesting to see that they did just buy a lot of the brands that I buy anyway. Um, interesting from a marketing perspective that they just sort of bought what they knew um, because we also buy these all the time. These are the Warburton Thin Bagels. Caleb really likes these with cream cheese in the morning. 
Then the boys also actually chose some veggies, which I was pretty pleased about. They love corn on the cob because it's nice and sweet and they can have butter on it. They also love carrots because they're nice and sweet and red peppers is probably their favorite veggie. Like they would eat that all the time if they could. Um, and then they did get some broccoli, which I was also really pleased about because it's such a battle to get them to eat it. Obviously being children, they had no look at like use by dates. And this broccoli does look a bit brown. Like I would not have chose this one and I wouldn't have chose one in the plastic. So that was interesting. But yeah, I don't know if you can see, it's kind of maybe going off a little bit already. So I think we're gonna have to eat that like tomorrow. Then in terms of fruit, um, Caleb grabbed this huge watermelon and it made me feel bad because I never buy watermelon because it's one of those fruits that like I'll cut up a bit and then I'll just, I feel like I waste it, but I'm determined for them to eat it. So I'm gonna cut it all up, put it into Tupperware tonight and then have it um, for their breakfast tomorrow. So yeah, that should be really, really nice. They also got some purple grapes. They also got four grapefruit. Matt has grapefruit every morning, but also Caleb really likes red grapefruit now with a little bit of sugar on top. Um, so he wanted that. They also got some strawberries for Jackson. That's what they said. We also got some rice because that is like Fraser's favorite side dish um, with meat or anything. He really loves rice with soy sauce. Now onto snacks. They chose some of the suckies. I do normally get this for the boys. It's just whole milk, yogurt, and fruit. And they actually ate two of them just while we were going around. Caleb had one, Jackson had one. So I've only got two left, and I think I'm gonna use it for the boys' snacks tomorrow for school. They also got these, which we've never had before, salt and vinegar twirls. And they have literally eaten nearly all of them on the way around. Um, so yeah, I have actually tried a few though, and they're so moorish, really, really good. First time I've ever had them. Then they've also chose popcorn. We normally get Metcalfs anyway. Um, so again, they sort of chose one that they know. Then Fraser was like, these are my favorite crisps ever. They serve them at school um, sometimes. So it's salt and vinegar crisps. Then they got pom bears for Jackson. They got snacker jacks in salt and vinegar. I was like, I normally buy you guys caramel. And they were like, nope, we want salt and vinegar this time. Then they also got these little fruit bowl raspberry yogurt flakes. Caleb and Jackson still really like these. Um, then they also got some pizza. I guess that could do for like a night this week. And they even got Matt's favorite one there. And then like this random little tiny one that Caleb grabbed, Hardy Food Company. Oh, also for snacks, they got these big breadsticks. I normally buy the baby breadsticks still. Uh, so maybe I need to stop doing that. But yeah, they chose these big ones. And then hummus, my boys just love hummus so much. Now onto sweets, they got a random pack of original Oreos, some fruit winders. I haven't bought these before. Um, but I think they've had them before at friends' houses, so they were like, we're having those. Um, I do normally buy the bear yo-yos. Jackson loves them. I literally fob them off as like pudding to him. He really likes them and they're just fruit. Uh, they also chose some of these Mr. Freeze freeze pops, which actually I was pretty pleased about. They're a nice like small size. So I'm gonna freeze those and they can have them throughout the summer. Then you would have seen they chose Jiffy Pop from the American section because they had that in America. And then they chose quite a bit of chocolate. They chose 10 10 dairy milk bars, uh, but they are quite small inside, so I was like, maybe they can have them as a treat. Um, they also chose four caramel bars. They chose three curly whirlies, but obviously two are now gone. And they chose three gingerbread men. Unfortunately, one is broken. And then the last thing was, I was like, oh boys, can we please buy some Unstoppables? Because um, I've run out, and Fraser was like, no, this isn't a cleaning shop, this is a food shop. And then Caleb felt sorry for me, so he chose this one, it's one of my favorite. It's like the lavish scent. So we got that as well. So that is everything the boys chose for our weekly food shop. I did point out to them that they didn't actually get that many dinners or lunches. So I think this week I'll be living off of Goujon sausages and maybe an omelette as well. But it was actually really interesting. I think it was educational for them as well. I thought they were going to go completely crazy with that trolley. When I gave them a trolley and I was like, choose what you want. I expect them to get so many sweets, but actually they were quite sensible. We went down the fruit aisle, they chose loads. They went down the veggie aisle, they chose loads. And it's really interesting because they chose so many brands that I do buy. Um, so it is like monkey see, monkey do. Um, obviously they chose quite a few like 
Chris, no, yeah, so many crisps, so many cookies, chocolate as well. But overall, it was pretty fun. Obviously, I wouldn't do this every week. I just thought this would be an interesting video and I hope you guys liked it. And yeah, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys.